Good morning. So, I finally have the motivation and the energy to wake up for a hike. I actually not only set an alarm this morning, I got up when the alarm went off. So, yeah, currently on a hike in Olympic National Park. The hike I wanted to go on is closed because there is or a kid got attacked by a cougar. Don't worry, the kid's fine. But the trail is closed, so I'm on a different trail to a different lake. But I think it worked out because this is... That's terrible. Really pretty already so far. Here's hoping I don't get stalked by a cougar, uh, but I do have bear spray, <laughs> just in case. <laughs> I don't know if that's going to do anything, but just in case. Look how steep this is. So I'm supposed to go down there, and I don't know if you guys can see, but we're just going to do all these switchbacks to go down there. That is kind of wild, but... That's really pretty. So, I've been hiking for, I think, like an hour and a half now, and it's just so quiet and peaceful out here, and I am straight up just getting assaulted by spider webs, and that's when you know this trail isn't really traversed a lot. Stopped a lot to take pictures just because it's so pretty, and I'm just really glad I woke up to do this hike.
almost at the lake. Kind of see it. So I was going to go in the lake, but it looks a little scummy. Um, so I think I'm just going to hang out here for a little bit, eat a snack, and then head back. But it's absolutely beautiful though. I don't care how old you are, a peanut butter and jelly sandwich always hits. I went exploring around the lake a little bit and I found a spot on the lake that isn't so scummy. Looks kind of deep though, so <laughs> I would inflatable. I bought this thing like a year ago for specifically this occasion or these occasion when I'm at a lake and I have yet to be able to use it. So we're gonna use it today. <laughs> See you guys back at the trailhead.
made it. I'm alive. Let me tell you, there were like from the lake back to the trailhead, there were roughly two miles worth of switchbacks. And let me tell you, I suffered. I cannot remember the last time I suffered that bad. And then to top it off, <laughs> towards the end, there were stairs. And I was like, oh my God, this feels, this hike felt a lot longer than eight and a half miles. But I'm thankful that I'm able to do this. And what got me going was this donut. I was thinking about this donut the entire time. Also, I found the very last, you can see it, coconut cream cake that I had thought I finished already, but I found one in my pack and that just made my day. Oh yeah, I'm gonna, oh, I'm still tired. Woo! I'm going to take a shower, go to the gym, stretch and take a shower and then go to this burger joint that I see pretty much every time I go to the gym and there is always people there. So I'm assuming it's good. So yeah. Oh, this is so good. I'll see you guys later. Well, we about to get strong. Jesus Christ, my hair. Why can't you just stay back? Sup? I got it. I'm a little nervous about it though. Okay, so I just got the frugal burger because I feel like a specialty would be good, right? Oh, this looks sad as hell. There's nothing on here that's special. It <laughs> so there's a patty, onions, pickles, mayo, and ketchup. There's literally nothing that's special about it. Good thing I went to the Jack in the Box, to the Jack in the Box. I went to Jack in the Box and got chicken strips. Well, I don't know what they're seasoned with, but they're good. But you can't really fuck up fries. Don't judge me. This is so sad. <laughs> okay, hold on. It's a regular hamburger. Probably should have gotten like a bacon cheeseburger or something. It's edible. Anyways, I'm at a park, Arbor View Park. I might stay here for sunset, but sunset's not for another few hours. So you may or may not see the sun setting here. Either way, I'm gonna end the video here. Thank you so much for watching. I'm glad you could come with me and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye.